we on Boss Talk 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. Yeah. And, and, and the biggest question that I have now for you is, can Bobby, OG Bobby Billions, uh, make make a other hit big as those hit, the, the outside thing? Do oh, yeah, they think, coming. No, no, do you think you can do it? I know I'm gonna do it. Do, it ain't even it, no, it ain't you, even no, it is not even no, no speculation for me. I know it's, I know it's gonna happen. I already got the music. So, so you feel like the next time when I hear something, I'm gonna be having you back on the show in oh, studio yeah. in Dallas. Yeah, I'm, <laughs> I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do that a hundred times for sure. You, yeah, you, I'm gonna do it a hundred. I'm gonna do that a hundred times. How do you know the formula to make that happen? Man, it just starts with making really good music. It just starts with like you say that different sound. Yeah, like it starts with making really good music. When, she, when I think that's the formula for just me, just making the really good music. Like, I, that's always been like once I when I started making music, I, I was t I tell my guys all the time, you know, don't worry. Once I when I drop my first project, it's going, it's going, it's going, it's going up. Like yeah, it's going up. Yeah, man, my boy, you know, he came on my on my platform. Oh, uh. Your, your partner there, a space boy, he he drops 16s and everything else. He's special, man. Space be your eyes, the freshest that's in the sky. No blessing, there's no disguise. I do this shit with no reason. I mean, no reason. The bi Billy, the billion, uh, how, who named him that? Did you name him that? Man, he named himself. Yeah. What, it, that, that ain't his <laughs> real name. No, it's not. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he done changed his name. I knew the nigga name wasn't that. Oh, Bobby man. Billions. I'm like, this it's, ain't no nah, hell, no. Nah. It's so funny and interesting, man, and it just goes. It just makes sense. I'm like, damn, but that's how that's how much of an impact that Billy Gang made in Dallas, in Texas, period, bro. I mean, those that know, know. And, you know, he Mo wasn't hey. one that grew up with us, but he, he, you know, raised with us. But, like, we started at 13. It was teenage billionaires. And... Man, we were just, you know, was bringing flavor. We was the, the niggas in the hood that's rocking skinnies and skateboarding. And, and you know what I'm saying? Just doing that's cool shit. That's how it happened. <laughs> we are just doing cool you shit, know, man. You know Mo 3 8 on that song, bro. Man, boy. <laughs> man. <laughs> that that, that, three, that song, he took that song to another whole high, you know, just level. I tell you. You know, that, that song, man, hey. It was already now. I love the way Bobby sing it, but it was something about when Mo three hit. It was, it was beautiful how it happened, bro, because it came out like 2019 or something like that. Yeah, like, uh, 2020, 2019. Sean Cobb was on here and he said 2020. Uh, they yeah. they actually linked up he with that song it. through on his uh, social yeah. media platform. Exactly. Bam. The song was out. It went crazy. Just uh, the original version. Mm -hmm. Not as crazy as Mo three. But it went crazy so much so that it was on radio. Wow. Like radio picked it up. The the regular version was getting played. And we all just like, bro, this is crazy. We like I I'm calling Bobby. I could have got that interview then in for sure. I didn't oh, I didn't have boss talk at the time. <laughs> I was like, damn, bro, every now and then we just driving and just hear your song, bro. We just, this this shit changing right now. Yeah. And so, you know, him being he a smart dude, bro. Um, he reached out to Sean Cotton, like you said. Yeah. Paid that fee, and Mo three heard it on there, and goddamn, he actually paid a fee to Mo three to for him to post it wow. on his on Mo three's page, and um, uh, he ended up doing his style on there, just yeah. doing his in the kitchen, just hitting that hoe. Yeah, and it that's how I mean you already probably don't heard the story, hey, and that's man. how that shit connected. Yeah, bro. that was dope. That was a dope story, man. I like and the I, way you just told it. And I'm gonna tell you straight up, being right there with every step, bro. I'm telling you, bro, Bobby. The whole time has had the notion of connecting everybody, bro. Yeah, yeah. We ain't, we ain't one for all that smoke beef and none of yeah, that. We yeah, wanted yeah. everybody to get this shit together on some, and it's just unfortunate what happened because now it seems like you got to choose a side. Yeah, well, you don't have to. That, I'm like, bro, I'm gonna on, be honest man. with you. That's why Boss Talk One and One pulled up in here because we bring unity. That's just how people think, though. We bring love. You hear me? People always think I, gotta pick a side. Yeah, but cycle, bro. We, we've taken this to a whole nother level. He, yeah, my he, boy he got on it. the fly, man. Yeah, with yeah, it. yeah, Spizzy and, got something. Now, man. Done, now, now, your your old name was Stan the Man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When I was, when I was <laughs> that's what he I told me. Yeah, yeah, he yeah, said that sure. man used to promote, man. He, 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 he I used to throw parties and yeah. stuff. That used to be my thing. I used to throw part. I was, I was, I was always the cool guy. Like I yeah. was, I was not just the cool guy. I was the coolest. Cool. I was the cool list. I was at the head of the cool table. You got the cool kids table. I was at the, I was at the top seat. Yeah. For sure. 
Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gon' talk.